Hello. <laughs> it's your friendly neighborhood um, person that can think for himself. Just gonna connect the dots since the liberals can't look anything up themselves and they will never go on the site to even search up their politicians and see if they're on here. But you know the World Economic Forum, Klaus Schwab. What a cutie. Talks about you'll own nothing and be happy. Oh, and reduction in the fertilizer, need to get rid of the farmers, climate change, and blah, blah, blah. Eating bugs and telling us we're going to have to prepare for a, for a angrier world. Why are we praying for an angrier world? And that was uh, last year's speech when he said that. You can just go look that up on YouTube, but I know you won't because it's YouTube. Ooh. It's a live speech that was from the news anyways, So, but it's on YouTube if you want to go look at it. I went on the economic forum. Look here, Christina Freeland, right on the economic forum page. <laughs> Trudeau's little henchman. How evil she looks. Thought this was, was a conspiracy theory that they were part of the economic forum. Uh, oh, look at this. Oh, look, Justin Trudeau as well. Wow. Weird that he's pushing for the 30% reduction in the farmers. That's just exactly what the World Economic Forum wants. And he's on the page. Weird. Is it easy to connect the dots? I think so. Must be still dubbed as a conspiracy theory. Oh, look, and they got the Johnson & Johnson vaccine company up there, too, as a partner with World Economic Forum and the rest of them in there, too, if you just go in there and do the research. <laughs> Probably too hard, though, isn't it? Oh, and they got Amazon and all kinds of big companies in there. Seems like they have just unlimited funding. Pup the puppet masters of it all, right? <laughs> it's still all a conspiracy theory. It's so hard to connect the dots. <laughs> Funny, everyone complaining about the trucker convoy, blaming everything on the trucker convoy. I'm pretty sure the Klaus Schwab convoy is way worse. About 50% of the population is part of that. And even so, that 50% will still vote for the liberals.